హలో ఫ్రెండ్స్ వెల్కమ్ టు ఈసీ అకాడమీ ఇన్ దిస్ లెక్చర్ లెట్ అస్ అండర్స్టాండ్ డిఎఫ్టి యాజ్ ఏ లీనియర్ ట్రాన్స్ఫర్మేషన్ విచ్ ఈస్ ఆల్సో నోన్ యాజ్ మెట్రిక్స్ మెథడ్ వినో డిఎఫ్టి క్యాన్ బి రిటర్న్ యాజ్ ఎక్స్ ఆఫ్ కే ఈజ్ ఈక్వల్ టు సమేషన్ ఆఫ్ ఎన్ ఈజ్ ఈక్వల్ టు జీరో టు ఎన్ మైనస్ వన్ ఎక్స్ ఆఫ్ ఎన్ డబ్ల్యూ ఎన్ to the power of kn where the value of k is ranging between 0 to n minus 1 here wn is known as twiddle factor or phase factor where wn can be given as e to the power of minus j 2 pi by n here w n to the power of k is periodic with period n now in this equation let us put the value of n which is ranging from 0 to n minus 1 let us put n is equal to 0 1 2 and so on up to n minus 1 in this equation at that case we will get x of k is equal to x of 0 if we put n is equal to 0 it will be x of 0 here if we put n is equal to 0 this term will become 1 so x of 0 into 1 plus if we put n is equal to 1 it will be x of 1 into w n to the power of k into 1 plus if we put n is equal to 2, it will be x of 2, wn to the power of k into 2, plus and so on. Plus, if we put n is equal to n minus 1, it will be x of n minus 1, wn to the power of k into n minus 1. So, k into n minus 1. For this equation, let us put k value which is ranging from 0 to n minus 1. So, if we put k is equal to 0 in the above equation, at that case, x of 0 will be equal to small x of 0 plus x of 1 into it will be 1 plus x of 2 into again this term will become 1 because k is equal to 0 plus and so on plus x of n minus 1 into again k is equal to 0 that's why it will be 1 if we put k is equal to 1 at that case we can write x of 1 is equal to x of 0 plus x of 1 if k is equal to 1 here 1 into 1 it will be 1 into wn to the power of 1 plus x of 2 wn to the power of 4 plus and so on plus x of n minus 1 if you put k is equal to n minus 1 at that case it will be wn to the power of n minus 1 so in the same way if we put different values for k and the last value for k is k is equal to n minus 1 at that case x of n minus 1 will be equal to x of 0 plus here if we put n minus 1 it will be x of 1 into wn to the power of n minus 1 into 1 plus x of 2 into w n to the power of n minus 1 into 2 plus and so on plus x of n minus 1 w n to the power of k is n minus 1 n minus 1 into n minus 1 now these equations can be written in the form of matrix 
so we can write in the form of matrix so here in LHS we are having x of 0 x of 1 and so on up to x of n minus 1 so we can write this matrix as x of 0 x of 1 and so on up to x of n minus 1 will be equal to here we need to write w values if you observe w value in the first equation here w n value is 1 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 so in the first row it will be 1 1 and so on and last value is 1 in the first column you can see wn value is 1 so we can write 1 1 and so on up to 1 so in the second row wn value is wn to the power of 1 then the next value is wn to the power of 2 and so on up to wn to the power of n minus 1 if we continue like this we can write the last row as wn value is 1 here wn value is wn to the power of n minus 1 and next value is wn to the power of 2 into n minus 1 and so on wn to the power of n minus 1 into n minus 1 and this should be multiplied by one more uh, matrix which is you can see x of 0 x of 1 x of 2 up to x of 1 so it is common in all the equations so we can write x of 0 x of 1 x of 2 x of 3 and so on up to x of n minus 1 so this matrix is n cross 1 which means it is having n rows and one column so this matrix is n cross n and the last matrix is n cross 1 so which means it is having n rows and 1 column symbolically this matrix can be written as for this matrix we can write a symbol as x of n is equal to so this entire matrix we can write it as wn into this matrix i will write it as small x n symbolically we have written this uh, equation let us call this as uh, equation number one using this equation we can find the dft of the given uh, sequence so we can use this equation and we can find dft of the given sequence let us pre multiply let us pre multiply above equation by wn inverse so here remember wn inverse is not the inverse of wn it is just the symbolic representation for representing a idft matrix so wn inverse is not the inverse of wn so it is just the symbolic representation to write the equation for idft so if we multiply wn inverse with this equation we can write wn inverse xn is equal to wn inverse into wn x of n so here these two will cancel out and we will be left out with wn inverse x of n will be equal to x of n so we can write this as x of n can be written as wn inverse x of n let us take this as equation number 2 we know id of t of the equation can be given as x of n is equal to 1 by n summation of n is equal to 0 to n minus 1 x of k w n to the power of minus k n so this is the id of t equation so this equation we can write it as 1 by n summation of n is equal to 0 to n minus 1 x of k 
डब्ल्यू एन टू दि पवर आफ के एन स्टार सो हियर स्टार रिप्रेजेंट कॉम्प्लेक्स कॉन्जुगेट बिकॉज वी आर हैविंग ए नेगेटिव साइन हियर वी कैन राइट दिस टर्म इन दिस वे बिकॉज स्टार रिप्रेजेंट कॉम्प्लेक्स कॉन्जुगेट हियर डब्ल्यू एन स्टार इज कॉम्प्लेक्स कॉन्जुगेट ऑफ डब्ल्यू एन सिंबॉलिकली the above equation we can write it as small x n is equal to 1 by n this we can write it as capital x n omega n star let us call this as equation number 3 using this equation we can find id of t of the given sequence so using equation 1 we can find d of t using equation 3 we can find id of t of the given sequence so if we compare equation 2 and equation 3 we can write if we compare equation 2 and 3 we can write x of n is common here and capital x of n is common in these two equation so we can write wn inverse is equal to 1 by n wn star so this is the relation between dft matrix and idft matrix so this is the dft matrix wn is the dft matrix so for this if we apply complex conjugate and divide by 1 by n we will get the matrix for idft so, this is about the dft as linear transformation or matrix method hope you have understood the topic thank you